Assalamu alaikum and good day. So our topic today is dentatrien. For removable partial dentatrien or RPD trien, it's divided into two, the trial dentatrien and the framework trien or the cobalt chrome framework trien. So we will go through the framework trien first. For framework trien, first thing first, you have to start with an inspection of the framework on the cast. Ensure that the framework is fabricated as how you have designed the partial denture. Make sure every component is seated well on the abutment teeth. You have to also um, run your finger on the fitting surface of the denture framework to make sure there's no sharp edges and no nodules. From this point onward, please pretend that the cast is the patient's mouth. The framework is then fitted intraorally. Then you have to check for fitting, extension, retention, and the stability of the framework in the patient's mouth. The framework fitting is then checked with disclosing material. You can use either fit checker or pressure indicating paste or PIP. In this case, I'm using PIP. PIP is applied with a brush all over the fitting surface. Please use a proper PIP brush. You have to be able to see the streak of PIP on the fitting surface. The framework is then reinserted into the patient's mouth and removed. Areas with pressure spots are indicated by displacement of the PIP where the metal show through. So you have to whack, you, you have to mark the spots with indelible pencils. Wet the indelible pencil first. Okay, all these pressure spots have to be removed with a burr. And you have to repeat this step if necessary until a passive fit of the framework is achieved. The other try-in step that you have to observe for RPD is the trial denture try-in. Trial dentures are tried in before the denture is processed into the final denture and is done after the teeth were set up in the framework. The main purpose for this try-in is to verify the denture intraorally and to check for aesthetics, speech and occlusal assessment. First step is to disinfect the denture before you fit the denture into the patient's mouth. Okay, after you fitted the denture in the patient's mouth, first check the lip support, especially if you're replacing the maxillary anterior teeth, as with the picture that I have on the left. Next, you have to verify the tooth shade and the size, especially if you're replacing the anterior teeth. You usually do this um, by getting the patient to have a look in the mirror under natural light and see if the patient also agrees to the choice of the tooth shape and size that you have made in the first place. For mandibular teeth, you have to verify the level of the teeth in relation to the tongue and you have to ensure that enough tongue space is given. Next step, you have to verify the vertical dimension. Um, you have to also check for the freeway space. You have to check for occlusion in centric relation and also in intercostal position. You have to verify for aesthetic and speech, especially for the consonants V, F and S. That's it for try-in and I would like to especially thank Dr. Elena for the videos um, that
that we have in our pres presentation today. Thank you.